Okay, so let us now move on to the simulation of this topic. We have here, as we can see on our screen, we have forces and motion base basics. And we have here the net force, motion, friction, and acceleration. But first, we have to click on the net force. There you go. So the window will show you the tug of war game with the red team at the right side and blue team at the left side. In the upper right side, check the sum of forces, values, and speed. In its lower side, turn on the volume. You can see the volume icon in there. There you go. Let's start off by setting a large person on a blue team. And we can just drag them up into any one of the knots and we've got to set them against a medium person on the red team. Okay, so we have here the medium person for the red team, the large person for the blue team. So let us just set them up side by side. Okay, let's add another, uh, the smaller one. Okay. And as soon as we hit go, the tug of war begins. Apparently, the large person on the blue team with a force of 150 newtons, and the medium person is pulling to the red team with a force of 100 newtons. The sum of the forces is shown here, right above 50 newtons. And as we expected, we can all call it as the net force. We can explore the simulation by dragging the objects you want on the box and observe what will happen. So you can drag the largest person, or you can just drag all of them. And the medium sizes, all for the red team and a big one. And let's start. Okay, so as we can see here, the forces are equal so that the object is not moving. Okay, let's try adding a net force to the left. Okay, so the blue team is obviously pulling the object. Okay, so let us now move on to the motion. So at the bottom part, you can see there the motion. Okay, so in this one, we have a person pushing on a cart. At the upper right side, check the force, values, masses, and speed. And at the lower right box, we have a girl, a man, a trash can, and a gift box. At the lower left side, we have a refrigerator and a box. If we select a positive force, they push, they will start to push at the right. And if we select negative force, they will begin to push at the left. We have a scale at the bottom that we can adjust forces with, or we can use the little arrows to jump up in 50 Newton increments. Okay, let's try adding up and lowering down. Next is let us try dragging the girl in the box and observe what will happen. Okay, so that is the girl on the box. And it is starting to push on the right side because it is a positive. And let's try the negative force to make it push on the left side. There you go. We can explore the simulation by dragging the objects you want on the box and observe what will happen. So let us try the refrigerator and a positive force. At the bottom part of this simulation, there is a friction box in there and click that. Just like the motion media, we have a person pushing on a cart. At the lower right side, we have a girl man and a gift box and a trash can 
At the lower left side, we also have a refrigerator and a box. The other upper right side, check the force, sum of forces, values, masses, and speed. And we have to adjust the friction scale to none. Okay, there you go. And observe what will happen. It is just like a big sheet of ice or even slippery. We can play it there or we can add as much friction as we want. Okay, so we can adjust it to lots. Force to the right, we can observe now that we have a force opposing the force exerted by the person. And that's what we call force of friction. We can explore the simulation by dragging the objects you want on the box and observe what will happen. So let us try putting the girl on the box. And the friction is into lots. And the Newton is 500. So as we can see here, there is no friction at all. Let us try. Okay, let us try the box. 500 Newtons. Let us now try the trash can with a weight of 100 kilogram. Okay, so a man can't push the, the object because it is too heavy for him. Okay, let us now move on with the acceleration. Please click acceleration. So again, just like the motion in friction media, we have a person pushing on a cart. And at the lower left side, we have a refrigerator and a box. At the right side, we have a girl, a man, and this time we have a water bucket. This time we have a acceleration scale. We can see the acceleration of or charge in motion more easily. And another way that we can visualize the acceleration is we have a bucket of water. As we add some forces, we get a net force here. It needs quite a big force to overcome the friction. Okay, let's try. We can see the bucket of water is tilting and that indicates some acceleration. We can explore the simulation by dragging the objects you want on the box and observe what will happen. So let us try putting the girl on the water bucket. So it begins to accelerate. Okay, let us put the friction to none. And Newtons to 500. Okay, so as we can see, the man is, move, is pushing the cart with much more ease because, of the, because there's no friction. Okay, that is all. I hope that all of you can um, explore and enjoy this simulation because this is very helpful in this topic. Thank you so much.